Hello everyone, welcome back to Wise Origins. Uh, I don't know where I'm going, so let's go left. That seemed to work last time. Alright, hello. Are these things I can kill? Well, obviously the one thing I can, I'm talking more- Oh. Right, so they seem to go around in like a large glorified circle eight-like pattern. You just go anywhere, alright. You are fairly durable. When I actually kill you, you just have like infinite HP going on here. But you do die, alright, I was gonna say. There's two of you? That's a nightmare. Terrible spot for me to be sitting. Oh, she just died. Is that everyone? Because holy cow, that's a nightmare. Okay, so there's that. Actually. No. We check some of these walls over here. No. Okay. And then, oh, we can just go pretty much any variety of ways. Alright. Oh, yeah, I suppose we should probably take this off so I can fight. Guys here are much more durable. The enemies are very drastic. This is quite the difficulty spike going on here. Ouch. Holy cow, you're just mad. They don't even flinch. Really, I can't interrupt their attacks like I'm used to. I cannot stop them from attacking, so this is quite the interesting increase, sharp increase in difficulty going on here. Yeah, see, I, they can just interrupt me at any time, and I can't push them out of it. Except for this. So durable. I hit like a wet noodle. And I'm gonna die. There I go. Because these things are so much more difficult. I'm gonna try the other path. Because holy cow, those things are incredibly tough. And I need something. Something else that I don't have is so these are way easier to kill. I'm doing actual double digits damage here. Oh goodness. Okay Yeah, this is this is fine. Okay, res. I bet he comes back All right Because he didn't drop deadly squat when I killed him and yeah, they do res all right, so we're gonna ignore these guys Oh More of you morons all right I just have to use Cyclone to keep these guys off of me. Alright. Uh -oh. 
So far, so good. Alright. You know what, actually? This is a pain in the neck. Let's see what's forward. We are clearly having some kind of... There's something I'm not doing. And I have zero indication of what possibly I could increase. Okay. Let's go forward then and see what's up here. Okay, double digits again. You guys are not going to it's, it's very specific enemy types. Alright, I'm just gonna I'm going to assume that that is not the way I'm gonna need to go. We're gonna go back over here. Shoot. Okay. Oh, this is an it. Alright. I'm missing something I'm gonna need. And I don't know what it is, but I need to get out of here. We're gonna go back left. Simply because I at least know for a fact that I'm not gonna have to deal with respawning enemies or anything like that over here. This is not quite what I mean by happening. Okay, there we go. This so I would actually have to use this thing, which is interesting. I'm actually doing double digit damage here. So it looks like the sword is my only real option. Yes. Okay, that helps a lot. That was a much shorter kill time. Interesting. So the axe, for some reason, I just ran right into that spike call. The axe, for some reason, is not the solution. It's more of a technical um, weapon at this point. It's what I would use for speed and uh, technical attacks. The lightning is a nice guard breaker, but that isn't really ultimately that effective. We're gonna go this way just because we can. Where we have these slimes. Alright, we're not quite hitting double digits here, but at the very least we're doing more than one damage, which is what the axe was doing. Also, the fact that it has such wide sweeping attacks does help with the slimes that split up, so that's fairly good. So we can actually keep the slime population decently under control, even with this. There we go. Yeah, that worked out nicely. I forgot I can stun them with that. Alright. Now I get it, at least. I have to use very specifically this weapon. The plain old fireball seems to be very effective. You can still teleport while you're stunned. That seems... Correct, but okay. There we go. Yeah, that's a lot easier to manage. What's actually up here? I'm going way up here. What is this? Right. Nope, not today. I don't know which one you are. Is it when I was originally killing? I can't tell. Must have been because this guy's taking a little longer. Yeah, he probably was. There we go. This is ice. That's interesting. Um, damn. Alright. That's pretty neat. I'm gonna really quickly check this wall for secret passages. Nothing. Okay. Just one. Oh, shoot. Oh, okay. I am totally done with that. That's cool. The evil ring. I remember this from the first one. Doesn't this kill me over time? And it makes me feel demonic? Ooh, wait, why are you up here? Oh, 
Okay. Well, I don't need that on currently, so we can just go ahead and put this on for now. What the hell? Okay. Alright. Now, can I step on this? No, I have to have the mask on to be able to even step on it. But that's fairly good to know, though. I wasn't sure if that would work that way. I knew the doors I couldn't go through without being able to see them. But I was wondering if I could go over the bridge while I couldn't see it to make it be an invisible bridge, but no. Alright. Need to get rid of the danger little guy over here. A lot of SP going on here. There we go. Alright, I want to go down here and whack... Oh, I can't whack these guys. The Marble Key. Okay. Fair enough. Oop. Um, I'm not really sure what that was about, but sure. That's where the bridge belongs. I don't think there's any kind of secret passage here, but I'll check really quick. No, there's nothing here. I just wanted to double check that. Now we're gonna go down here, nothing here, okay. Nope, this is... Just fall down here and roll with that. Alright, any secret passages there? No, but we have those guys here that I gotta get rid of. Okay, so you guys still take barely anything from me, but at the very least I can flinch you with this sword, so there's that. This thing is killing me. Fire seems to be more effective against these guys than anything else. Ouch. That was useless. I like how it spreads out in a phoenix pattern. I think that's cool. Shoot. Those guys are a pain in the neck, but I can accept divine blessings. Yes. I assume, yeah, that's the only version of that. Increased stun effect. Yes. This doesn't have a level, so this is going to be the next thing we save up for, is the increased item drop rate. That'll give me, theoretically, more SP. Now, I want to see if there's anything else over here. I'm going to ignore that guy for now. Let me see what's up over here. Shoot. Holy cow, they hit like steam engines. guys even die? I don't think I've ever successfully killed any one of these guys. I'm not convinced they can actually die. They can die. They are absolutely not worth the effort. 
Right, I already know there were no, like, secret anythings up there, as far as I know. Is there anything over here? Maybe. Think about it? Not really. There's this pose up here. Really not worth it. In terms of actual effort. Because for some bizarre reason, I just don't hit them that hard. Hmm. The second one definitely confirmed that they are simply not worth the time. Okay. This is even what's going on there. We'll save really quick because that whole fiasco was a nightmare. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Stupid green blood. Ah, come on. Come on. Ah, shoot. Nope, come on. There, okay, he died at the very least, so now we can move on. Slide everywhere, again. Okay, that's convenient that they're all stuck down there. I like that a lot, thank you. Can you stay down there? You... I mean, you're fine, I guess. Just the one individual... There we go. This makes it, dealing with this one individual very easy. Okay, so much for that. They're all gonna stay there? Perfect. You just stay there. Oh, this one guy is fine. I'm not too concerned about this one. Oh, that's a green blood over there, so he's gonna wacky right there. That's good. Good. He's just died in the sand. Perfect. Ow. I have to go all the way around. Oh, and then there's you. Alright. Okay, at least they don't always come back up here. Shoot. I'm gonna die. Get out of here. Jump, moron. Thank you. Alright. Is it because I was on the low level? I'm level 25, so that's not that bad, but I don't know what the max level is. Elevated fire is really not worth it. Okay, good. So far, so good. Shoot. These guys hit like steam trains. They may die or temporarily die really quick, but they hit, like, absolute steam engines. What the heck? Nope. Ah, shoot. Get out of my face. Oh, come on. Fire makes these guys flinch. Interesting. Now 
No. Thank you. Nope. Jump, jump, thank you. Ah. Why is this one being such a problem? The one I had a problem with last time. Amen. Alright, that's that one gone. Let me have this idiot. Gotta make sure that they, I burn them often enough. Stop that. Stop that. Nope. I died. That's so annoying. This is an absolute pain in, in the neck to deal with. Alright, so there's one of you right there. I already died? Why? How did I already die? What do I respawn with? 30. Why? Why do I respawn with such a low amount of health? What kind of idiocy is that? Just bring me back at full, for Pete's sake. So I'm right, like the save is right there. That's one down. Okay. I wish I could, like, jump. There we go. I see what I'm doing wrong. Okay. See, the third attack of the chain is abnormally slow. I just missed an attack there, which is why I was able to pop off his uh, poison goo stuff. But the third attack of the chain is abnormally slow, so if I don't throw a fireball at that specific moment, he's going to get off a group of poison. So I need to make sure that when I use my... I basically am trying to attack cancel with the final hit of the combo there. He's gonna... Oh, no, he went into the ground. Let's go. That was well timed for him going into the ground. All right, we got that. Now that I've figured out exactly what I need to do with this particular weapon, I basically need to attack cancel. We're pretty much golden. All right, so I've got the marble key, which is probably one of... I'm gonna guess two keys I need. There's a bunch of you idiots. Holy cow, there's a ton of you guys. What is this? A convention? Yeah, it's a convention. Alright. Just need some of you guys to die off. I randomly... Not only level up, but I randomly get a... Oh, they're healing each other. That's what the problem here is. Alright. This is nauseating. You relax for two seconds. I see the problem is I'm getting stuck underneath them. No, stop healing each other. Stop that. All the enemies here are supremely annoying for one reason or another. 
Okay, there's one down. Okay, that's okay. That means that this guy will be yeah, I was gonna say really easy to kill because there's no one to heal him. None of those respawning goons, so I suppose it's a lot better than it used to be. Holy cow, there's a lot of projectiles falling on the sky, but I've taken out one of them already, so that's fairly nice. Here we go. Check what this is, and check really quick for a nice hidden door or something. Nothing? Alright. I've, I'm now doing more damage to you guys, alright? Probably from the level up. So basically what you're telling me- okay, do double- double the, the fire now. Basically what I've- what I'm being told is I'm under leveled somehow. Which is weird because I've been pretty aggressive with killing off as many demons as I can. So I'm not sure how I've become under leveled here. But that is- that is essentially what I'm being told with this information right here. Now that I'm doing double digits to these people, I'm level 26 I think now? Maybe 27? I'm actually killing these guys in a decent amount of time. In other words, in short, I simply was too low of a level. Interesting. What level am I? Yeah, I'm level 26. Before I jump down there, I want to make sure that there's no secret doors along this back wall here. Alright, we're good. Very interesting. This must be the door I need the marble key for. I'm not quite ready for that, but now I know it's there. There's a bunch of U-Bees, alright. Trying to take these guys out as quickly as possible. So that way they don't heal each other. We'll get this one down. You can see them trying to heal each other right now. That's only one down, which is good. Nope, you are not gonna you are not gonna heal it. Okay, good. Healer is gone. I'm gonna get rid of you next. The slimes by themselves are pretty easy to deal with. Actually, I think I just wiped that monster from my mind. Actually, since there's only one of you left, let me take care of you really quick now. While I have that rare opportunity. There we go. I mean, I can do with the experience, obviously. Apparently. I have to get even more aggressive about killing enemies. Right. No, not another one, idiots. Where are you at? There you are. Just got absolutely decimated by that. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, let's see. Here's that door that goes to the other area that I was looking at. Ah, shoot. All right. Oh, you're down there now? Really? Wait, can you come back up here, please? Thank you. Alright, so I know where that door goes. I want to see what's up here. Great. This goes to a chest. This chest. A road of fruit. I'm actually glad I came up here then. That's that's fairly useful. Alright. Good. There we go. I hate these guys when they fly. Get out of the air. Oh, 
Appreciate it if you'd all just drop dead really quick. Thank you. You can do with less healing. Thank you. Where you at? Where you at? There you are. Just that. Good. Okay. Alright, we're just gonna run through this room because it snaps. Ah, no, we should probably save now that I've got everything that I want to get over here. Or could get over here. Save really quick and then we'll see what's past the marble door. I'm just gonna run through this room because I don't want to deal with the infinite resurrecting dweebs. Doors on the other side. Is this, is this going on? Different? There's a room over there. Hello. How do I get to the room? That's what I've got to figure out. I know I need experience, but I'm going to ignore these people. Hmm. How do I get to the root? That's not it. Nothing over here either, alright. That's trouble. I guess we'll just go through the marble door and, and figure it out. Nope. I was not anywhere near completely prepared for you guys. Oh, look at all how little damage I'm doing. Poorly. Yeah. Alright, so what we're gonna do... Where do I restart from? Right here. Alright, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop the episode here, and I'm gonna do some leveling up. I'm gonna do some, some farming. Because clearly the problem right now is that I'm grossly underleveled somehow. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode here, and I'll be leveling up for the next episode. And uh, we'll run with that. So thank you all very much for joining me. If you liked this, please like and subscribe. If you didn't, please ignore me. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, ideas, suggestions, or requests, please leave them down in the comment section below. And thank you all very much for joining me, and have a great 24 hours.